Hey, welcome, welcome. This is Marcus Bowles, President and CEO of Customized Minds. Thank you for joining me, tuning in, getting some more great information. It's, of course, going to inspire and empower you. You know, I'm pumped up. We got some more great information coming to you that is going to inspire and empower your life. So you, of course, can be that super achiever that you're looking to be, that I know you are, and, of course, maintain that status. Today, we got another great topic, so let's dive straight in. We're going to be talking about finding your solution. Yup. I'm going to help you find your solution as I always do. I make it simple, straight to the point. And if it hits you, that means I didn't mean to miss you. So how do you find your solution? Well, a lot of us, of course, we have problems, right? You know, yeah, you have a problem, I have a problem. You know, we've experienced some different things. We all have challenges, adversities, something that we're looking to overcome in our life, whether it be, you know, massive such as depression or anything like that, or simply, you know, overcoming a hurdle in business, you know, running into a barrier or what feels like a setback. Whatever the case may be, we all have different problems, challenges, adversities that we're looking to overcome. Here is what's sweet about this, right? You're not the first. Oh, oh, say that a little bit louder, Marcus. Hey, you are not the first that is experiencing the problem, challenge, adversity that you are facing in this world. Let me say that one more time because I don't think you're hearing me. You, yes you, right here looking at me, you are not the first to experience the problem, the challenge, the adversity that you are having right now in this world. Why is that good news? Well, it's good news because you have access to information. Yes, you are living in the 21st century, and if this video makes it beyond then, hey, you're living in a better century than now, you have access to information, meaning history, research, solutions on how other people have overcome, may not be the exact same, but similar challenge, adversity, or problem you are currently facing. Let me say that again one more time. You have access to information history, solutions that people have experienced similar to what you're going through. Therefore, you can utilize what they have done and maybe shape it and mold it in your own unique way to overcome what you are looking to overcome. Again, that sounds so simple, but a lot of the times people, us, we go out trying to create trying to find something new. There is nothing wrong with being creative and, and new. We are creative beings by nature. But at this point in human history, we are now actually just recreating, taking bits and pieces of problems and so, uh, solutions from other places, other things, history and information and creating a new solution. Me personally, Eh, I haven't really done too much creating. I have done part two, taking information and solutions from other people, from other things, from other history and past and creating something new. Yes, because I understand that what you might be going through or someone else might be going through may be the same or similar problem that I have that I'm looking to solve and share with the world, but I don't have to start from scratch. I can honestly start at 90, 95% of the way to the new solution that I'm looking to create by leveraging what I just shared with you. And I want you to do the same. See, regardless if you're depressed or if you're worried or if you're trying to overcome something, utilize the internet, utilize the information, utilize your resources that you have at your fingertips to get you your solution. I promise you, it's there. You may have to do some tweaking to it, 
You may have to pull from multiple sources, but the solution you are looking for is right at your fingertips. And I'm gonna leave you with that. It's right there at your fingertips. You have exactly what you say now. If you believe it now, it's yours to have right now today. The power of life and death is in the tongue, more importantly in the mind, but first, you gotta believe in your heart. I believe I shared some valuable information with you and it's going to change your life and you do great things with it. Feel free to share it with us as you go along your journey and finding your solution. Take care, bring back a friend, and I'll see you on the next one. Thank you.